stare all you want. At least I'm looking cute. Hey guys, so this is going to be my October, or not my October favorites, my fall favorites since I, I skipped October, so yeah. Let's start off with the beauty favorites, and my hair is in my lip gloss. The first thing I've really been liking um, for beauty products is this Rimmel London Stay Matte Pressed Powder. And this is what it looks like in a um, hip pan. Um, I really don't like it when people say that. I'm proud to share the news. And um, yeah, and I really like this because it just, it doesn't make your face look I don't even know why that's playing. Whatever. Never been laying on the cold hard ground. Oh, oh. Okay, where was I? Um. Oh yeah, I really like this because um, it keeps like it doesn't make your face look powdery, but it keeps it from getting oily. And I just really like it. And um, it's only about five dollars. And I don't know. I just I think you guys should. Really try this out. I have been addicted to this Wet n Wild lipstick, and this is in the color Breeze. And um, this lipstick was only 99 cents. And I don't know, it's just this really nude color. And I really like wearing nude lips um, in the fall. And yeah, even though my lips are like bright red right now, but usually I'm wearing a nude lip. And yeah, I just felt like going crazy. But um, yeah. And then lately I've been putting this um, lip gloss from Jordana over it. And this is called TTYL. And again, it's just a really nude lip gloss. And I think this is only like $2. So um, these are like awesome when you put them together. Last beauty related thing is these two brushes. And um, these are both from e.l.f. And um, I'm going to be honest with you, I really did not like these at all when I first got them because they shed a lot when you first buy them but once like all the loose hairs get out then they are amazing brushes because they were only a dollar a piece and this is a total face brush and um, yeah it's really soft and I just I, I really like it and then this is a blending eye brush yeah and they're both really amazing and you guys need to try these now for random favorites I don't know what that is sunshine lollipops and rainbows everything that's wonderful is what I feel when we're together okay I I need to stop like right now you did not see that since I love yummy smelling stuff over the fall time like who doesn't but um I've been burning a ton of candles this fall and this is a candle that I got from the dollar store for only a dollar and this is in the color ugh, not the color this is in the scent gingerbread cookies and this is a perfect fall scent it's so cozy it's so yummy and ugh, like I just I get hungry when I smell it which isn't always a good thing but it is awesome and for a dollar you cannot beat it and another yummy smelling thing that I really been liking is this air freshener and this is in the color color again what am I saying this is in the scent apple and cinnamon and it just smells like apple pie but like seriously I've gone through like four of these and I don't know they're just so awesome and when you walk into my room you can definitely tell like this works because I don't know a lot of times it just seems like air fresheners don't really make a difference but this one really really does I have an accessory that I've been wearing a ton it is this spike bracelet that and I have been looking for one of these forever like you don't even know um, I've seen so many of these online like at forever 21 and stuff but I haven't seen one in a store by me yet and I've been like looking for one for so long and I seriously flipped out when I saw this. I'm like, oh my god, I have to get this. I don't care how much it costs, I'm gonna buy this. And believe it or not, it came with like a bundle of bracelets and I'm actually wearing them right now. They look like this. And it came with a little spike bracelet and um, the bundle was only three bucks. And I got them at Burlington Coat Factory if you're wondering. But oh my god I was like flipping out I'm so happy I found this this like it's perfect for layering bracelets and just anything and also it's like a multi-purpose item like you can just put it on when you're having a bad day and when people bother you you can just go wham 
and your problem solved just kidding i don't know what is happening this year but we had a super hot summer and then it's like really really cold really early like it has been like freaking 30 degrees out it seems like every single freaking day and it's november i've been pretty mad but in this chilly weather i've been wearing a lot of cardigans and i just wanted to show you a couple that i've really been enjoying this um fall and this one is from air pastel and i've had this forever um i actually bought it like three years ago when i used to be a little tomboy and i thought this was just so cool and i never really wore it until like this year so but i'm really happy that i bought this when i did and i don't know it's just this really cute like striped cardigan and it's really long and this is super cute with like a pair of brown tights and a scarf and like some boots it's adorable so i also have been wearing this cardigan by forever Tw from forever 21 a lot it's just this plain white flyaway cardigan and it's just you know it's kind of hard to show you and hold it up but it looks so good on and maybe i'll have to do an outfit of the an outfit of the day when i wear this next but i've just really been loving cardigans for this fall time and my feet get really cold so i am like a hoarder of slippers and and like those really furry socks but these like i i can't even explain how much i love these yeah they're like freaking uggs but in slipper form i'm not even joking like they are so 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 soft like, oh my god, I could just like sleep on these. They're so comfy and, and just saying, they look really cute with a pair of dark skinny jeans and I wear these out in public all the time. I don't care what people think of me. Stare all you want, at least I'm looking cute. Now, music time. Okay, so I have been listening to Christmas music. Yes, I admit it, okay? I know it's only the middle of November, but I have been obsessed with Christmas music. I'm sorry, but that's just how I am. And yeah, I've listened to this so many times. This is just the Now That's What I Call Christmas CD. This is the um, like fourth version of it, so it's volume four. First CD just has like um, a bunch of Christmas songs sung by Rihanna and um, like Sean Kingston and Maroon 5. And there's this one song by Lady Gaga. It's called Christmas Tree. You guys need to go um, listen to it. I'll put the link down below. And you have to tell me what you think of it. It is so screwed up. I'm just saying. Just just putting that out there. And then the second CD just has like the classic Christmas songs that I love. But um, I'm, I'm getting ready for Christmas. I already have my Christmas tree set up. I have garland around my bedpost. I'm planning on doing a video like how to decorate your room for Christmas. But yeah, I'm pretty freaking excited for Christmas just saying for my other song favorites um i've really like i have been obsessed with the song headstrong by trapped i will link all my song favorites down below like i always do it is the best hardcore rock song ever you will be addicted that's all i gotta say as some of you guys might know um taylor swift released her new album like recently i think it was in october maybe yeah i think so but um i downloaded like all her songs and oh my god the album is awesome, like, I'm not even joking, the whole entire album is amazing, and people tell me all the time that I look like Taylor Swift, I don't see it, I'm sorry, like, when I'm just walking through the store, people are like, oh my god, you look so much like Taylor Swift, I'm like, people come up to me all the time and tell me that, like, I'm not even joking, people on YouTube, people at school, my family, it's, it's psycho, enough about that, I really love her song, um, Trouble. Like, that is my favorite song on her entire album, I swear. My next song favorite is Loud by Mac Miller. If you want to listen to it, I will link it down below. But just saying, if you like rap music, best rap song ever. And my last song favorite for this month is Ready or Not by Bridget Mendler. I don't know if you guys know the song, but it is amazing. It's like um, an awesome pop song that pretty much anyone will grow on. It is amazing, and I just, I love it. Like, it describes my life. So 
I'm very mad right now um, because I needed to film the ending of my video and someone's in my seat. She stole my seat and she won't even look at me. How nice. Hey. Hey. You can't just do that. Now she's going to sleep. Alright, so um, hopefully you guys enjoyed my um, fall favorites video. Say bye. Say bye. Look. Look in there. Look. <laughs> bye guys.